Thank you. Well, she is a 21 year old accounting student and an entrepreneur, and now she hopes to add the title of Miss USA to her resume. Katerina Romizel is Miss Georgia USA 2019, and she is joining us this morning. Good morning, Katerina. Good morning. All right, so you won this title back in November, yes, right? Okay, correct. tell me a little bit about the journey to this. Is this a goal that you had been working toward for a while, or was it something that was a new endeavor for you? Um, it is something I've been working on. I saw the pageant online and also. So I work for a company called Sherry Hill and they encouraged me to compete. And so I was like, hmm, I kind of want to do this. Mm -hmm. It looks kind of fun. And so I did it and now I'm here. I was going to say, once you've done it, you've gotten the bug, right? And, right. And felt yes. compelled to keep going. Absolutely. Okay. Let, let's talk about that moment when you were selected Miss Georgia USA. We uh, have some video, I believe, of that moment that you were crowned. And I know when I was watching it, it seemed like there. it took a while for the reality to really sink in about yes. what this was going to mean for you. Tell me about this. Yes, I it, I don't remember any of it, <laughs> but uh, I was just so thankful. I remember saying thank you, thank you, thank you, looking at each of the judges and thanking them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so it's, it's, I imagine it's been a pretty amazing journey so far just over the last, what, six months or yes, so? Yes, absolutely. Mm -hmm. It's been so fun. We've been in the preparation process sure. for Miss USA. And also I've gotten the opportunity to bring to light some of the amazing causes that are near and dear to mm -hmm. my heart, like human trafficking awareness, which is so important in Atlanta, mm -hmm. and also funding underprivileged entrepreneurs, because I am one as well. Oh, right, and I did want you to talk a little bit more about that, because you did start your own business at the age of 19. Yes. And now you do want to help others to start their own business. How are you encouraging that? Right. So as a female entrepreneur, I've only had my company called Katerina Cosmetics for about two years. But I work with this amazing organization called Kiva, spelled K-I-V-A. Mm -hmm. And they're a crowdfunding platform that takes donations and donates, allocates them towards the startup costs of businesses created by entrepreneurs in underprivileged communities. Mm -hmm. So all around the world. And it's so amazing to be a part of that. And very inspiring. So you have a lot of passions and interests, which all go into preparing for Miss USA. I did read, though, that uh, there has been 16 states that have not had a winner at Miss USA. Georgia is one of Georgia's them. And Georgia is one of them. What do you think you're going to bring to the table that could bring the crown home to Georgia? I want to go in there and show that I'm a hard worker. I have worked on being a superior communicator, but also I'm a generous listener and I just want this platform to bring to light the organizations and causes that are closest to my heart. Mm -hmm. What I also found interesting about you is you were the oldest of six sisters, is that correct? Yes, I am the oldest. Oh my goodness. Five what's younger it, sisters. What's it like growing up with that many sisters? Um, I always like to say if it's ever completely silent in the house, something is wrong <laughs> because it's always noisy, always chaotic. Yeah. But. Okay, you shared with us a couple of childhood photos. I want to know if there is a story behind this one right here. Yeah, so I was about four or five years old in that Aww. photo. And this my mom, precious. I was crying because my mom could not come be in the picture with me. Aww. So I had to take it alone. <laughs> that is sweet. Your Miss USA headshot looks a lot different than that, though. <laughs> yep. All right, so you've got a whole cheering squad behind you then with six sisters and your whole family behind you. Um, when are you leaving for Reno for the competition? I leave Friday. Okay, so mm -hmm. what are the last minute things you're doing to be ready for this? Uh, last minute wardrobe fittings, interview practice, because the interview top five question, you know, where you pick out of the fishbowl, oh, yeah. have to answer it on the spot. Just lots of preparation. Last is minute. there a part, a phase of the competition that you enjoy the most? Yes, mine, my favorite is the most nerve wracking part, the on stage question. Okay, yep. well that's good. You're ready to tell tackle it then. Yes. All right. Well, we are so. eager to cheer you on and we'll be watching for you. Well, thank you so right. much. Good I'm luck so to excited. you. Yeah. And uh, Katerina Romazel, Miss Georgia USA. She is uh, going to be competing in the Miss USA pageant. That's Thursday, May 2nd. You can catch it right here on Fox 5.